Um, this need glib. Oh yes, that's right, and FOP needed quite a lot more. Yes, I'm not going to install that again now, but I can install glib now. And this is the one where I've got to install it, and then install these two fellows, and then rerun it. I think, I think that's right. Tools. Yeah, we've got. Yeah, we haven't got Glib. Yeah, that's right. I need to install this first. Oh, but well, these are runtime, so I don't need to reinstall this after I've done these other ones. So that's okay. So let's just check the dependencies again. We've got libxslt. We've got PCRE. We're leaving out Dbus, GDP. We've got these two, and GTK doc to build the API documentation. So that's okay for now anyway at least. Um so let's remove GTK doc. Uh bash. Oh I'm in it still on time. And in here we go back to what was GTK dot, wasn't it? So we go back to the main page and look for glib. Okay, so we need to find this. It's in nine under general libraries. So it's 2.62.4 up there. So let's check if I've not already downloaded this. I think I have. Yep. And the patches as well. Okay, so I can extract this now. start installing them by putting the patches in. So the first is skip warnings and the second is security patch. And then Oh yes, that's right. This was we we started this and stopped because we wanted to build the API documentation. So we need to add in an extra um, option for the configure. So I'll copy that much, paste that in, and then. Let's take a look down here. I'm going to add in minus D doc equals true. Minus capital D D O C equals true. And with any luck this will work um, and allow us to build the API documentation. So I just need to add in that double dot there, which I presume means parent directory. Okay, so all I need to do now is run the Ninja program to build it.
Okay, so that seems to have finished. Oh yeah, these are these errors that are mentioned in this note down here. Error no ID from constraint link end. So we can ignore that. And although it says that's when it's installed, so maybe it's actually just part of the build and it just fails. The Julib test suite requires desktop file utils with some tests. However, desktop file utils requires glib in order to compile therefore you must first install glib and then run the test suite okay but we haven't got the desktop file utils obviously so what we need to do here now is we'll run this in and install it oh it actually says down here you should install desktop file utils and shared and then proceed to run the test suite okay so that's good so let's become the root and copy the installation commands and that looks like that's completed So now we need to, we're in the build directory in glib here, so that's worth remembering. That's where we need to be when we go back to run the tests. So let's go back to BLFS now. And we'll install desktop file and then shared MIME info. Okay, so we're 